I'll just show you this game. If you ain't already downloaded it, it's a free one. It's called Candy Crush Saga. I'd advise you not to download it because it's it is free. Don't get me wrong. It's addictive. I think it's hard. Basically, it's a simple process. You get start. Obviously, these ones are easy. Make your way around. You do the little levels, and you get to the next level. I'm here, 29. But this is paid stuff. But for the paid stuff, look at the sort of price. That's one forty-nine. Sixty-nine p. Just, for, just has to be just for like one, one thing. I play. I've been stuck on this level for a few goes. But you've got stuff up the top to buy. I don't know if I can buy it from here. Yeah, look. I thought I did see one that was like 29 quid. Look, 27 quid. <clears throat> you think what a full price game is? Like a lot of PlayStation or Xbox. 27 quid, and this is all you're going to get is let you paint a candy once per game. So it's naughty. This is a game like the old kind of Tetris setup, or whatever these games are called in here. Do this, and on this one, I've got to get rid of all these. But you got, there's the moves 59 moves. This is probably still one of the easiest levels. But a lot of people like you get special things like that, that's a bit more powerful. And but I'm going to delete it because it's. It's proper addictive and it's it's a bit tough and I think they want you to buy stuff. I'm about this gone but they want you to buy stuff. I'm sure a lot of people love this game but nah, it's not for me. Do this. Do your little things and you got I think they call these bits, oh, I can't remember now. You have to clear all these to do the level. Not doing this and getting them down there or something. a lot of people are going to say no it's the greatest game the world's ever seen but nah that's all I'm going to say so if you've got there's a special so it clears the load so if you've got 10 minutes on the bus or whatever but don't really nah I advise people not to bother especially when they're charging that sort of price for add-ons in the game that you most probably need to finish it unless you hack it and all that whatever but So I've got to clear all these and I ain't even got none down there yet. Trying to get one. To be honest, no, I've never been too clever at these sort of stupid games. Yeah, this game's getting a lot of a lot of ratings at the moment. Oh, look. More can go down here. I see why because it is a bit addictive but I honestly wouldn't bother even though it's free. I wouldn't bother. I have a little special there. Like I say, I've been on this level, I've probably had about five, six goes at the same level, can't do it. Don't know what I'm doing now. You know, this is Candy Crush Saga. Should be called Candy Crush. Or we'll Crush Your Wallet. If you want to buy in stuff, in uh, in-app purchases, that's what they should call it. Or we'll Crush Your Wallets. But you don't have to buy them. You obviously don't have to buy the uh, little add-ons. I'd rather they charge 50p for the game and not worry about the add-ons, but I'm sure they make money that way. This is what companies like doing nowadays. I suppose if no one bought the add on, they would stop doing it, so. Stop buying them damn add ons! I'm scared up my nerves already, to be honest. Music's driving me mental. People probably saying, oh you're playing it wrong now, you've got to do this, you've got to do this, you've got to do the backflip, some sort, you've got to do it seven bits of candy in a row. Be honest, I can't be bored.
Ah. There it is. Greatest game in the world. Candy Crush. He said oh, I've got seven moves left. I ain't gonna do this because there's too many things. But I can't say I'm really concentrating to be fair with it. <laughs> 